Hi everyone. Uh, in this session, I will be explaining how to clone the Bitbucket repository using SSH protocol. When you click on clone, you will see two options here. One is SSH, another is HTTP protocol. So by using either one of it, you can clone your remote repository to your local system. In this session, I will be explaining how to clone remote repository to your local system by using SSH. So what is SSH? SSH is a protocol which uses key value pair authentication while connecting to a repository. So here we will be generating two keys. One is public key, another is private key. We will be using these two keys to connect with our remote repository to our local system. So how this has to be done? I will be explaining this with step by step process. So SSH key authentication is more secure than HTTP is we have to generate public key and private key private key is the one which you store it in your local machine and public key is the one which is copied to remote repository for authentication purpose let's start step by step process to build connection between your remote repository to your local system so let us copy this url copy to clipboard go back to your jit terminal this is my jit terminal right click and paste it we have not yet generated the public key and the private key and we are not done the setup but we are trying to connect with the ssh url let's see what is the error we get on this terminal once you place this url please press on the enter here you can see could not read from remote repository and here permission denied because we have not yet generated private key and public key and we not yet copied public key to our remote repository settings so that is why when you try to connect to remote repository from your local system it's throwing an error saying that permission denied it's not authenticated to do this activity so before we start connecting to remote repository we have to generate private key as well as public key and we have to copy that public key to our remote repository okay so let's start with the uh, generating public key as well as private key so to generate private key and the public key we have a command ssh hyphen keygen press and enter enter file in which you want to save the file click on enter enter the passphrase here i'll just uh, give an empty space and click on enter again the same yes now it generated private key and the public key so to list those private key and the public key we have a command i just clear the window to list the files command is ls tilde backslash dot ssh press and enter here you can see two files has been generated one is private key and this is public key so you have to copy this public key and add this key key to your remote repository so that when you try to connect with ssh url it will build a connection to your remote repository so we have to copy this public key to copy this public key we have a command clip less than tilde backslash dot ssh backslash id underscore rsa dot pub this is a public key press and enter key has been copied to your clipboard now go back to your bitbucket repository left side down the corner you will see a symbol with your name so click on that click on personal settings under security click on ssh keys click on add key paste the key this is the key and give a label to it i will give default key as my label name then click on add key now you can see your key has been added here now you have copied public key generated in your terminal to your remote repository and you kept your private key in your local system now by using this private key and the public key you can build a connection with the remote repository to your local system so now we'll try to clone the repository by using shh url go back to your repositories click on bitbucket repo so here you can see clone option click on clone option select ssh copy this url go back to your jit terminal right click paste ssh url press and enter enter pass phrase for key i have given just empty space and enter and it's connected so now the remote repository has been connected now i have navigated to my local system repository and this is how 
you can connect to remote repository by using ssh url thanks for watching this video please do like comment and share it with your friends thank you